Well, Trent is the big competitive pistol shooter in the family. Even though all the boys are amazing shots, they also all work hard. We all enjoy hunting together, but we also enjoy working together. Well, most of the time. Certainly times we all want to choke each other, but that's far to have it a family business where we all work together. Well, despite everybody chipping in and helping everybody, we all kind of have our own categories. I haven't figured out mine yet, but Jeb is pretty much in charge of the farming and the cattle operation. Seth is running the outfitting business and helping guide hunters. Trent is finishing up school and also competing in a lot of handgun tournaments and also chipping in wherever he's needed, whether that's farming, cattle, helping guide, working around the ranch, feeding animals, a little bit of everything. Today's video is brought to you by Black Rifle Coffee Company. Well, we have a fall turkey season here in Colorado, and in Southern Colorado, that's an over-the-counter tag. And you can also use any weapon that's legal to find by the Colorado Division of Wildlife. Well, that includes most rifles, that includes both shotguns, it includes handguns, bows, crossbows, a little bit of everything. So sometimes we will go out and mix it up and try and take birds with different weapons. Well, me and Trent decided to go out this year and see if we could harvest some turkeys using a Rossi lever action. Well, first me and Trent hit the range to make sure the rifle was on. After confirming it on some water bottles and a couple other fun targets, we decided to see if we could do one other thing, and that was to shoot a spray paint can out of the air. Now, bear in mind, we know we have a safe distance of at least four miles straight out from where we're shooting. So, no issues on the safety of shooting up in the air at the angle we were shooting. But, it was time for me and Trent to have a little bit of fun and a little bit of a competition. I told him I thought I could shoot a paint can if he threw it up in the air. I said it may take me one or two shots, but I'm pretty sure I can get it. But we'll each get three shots and see what we can do. further out. Woo! Second shot, I smoked it. Ready? Oh, God. <laughs> so that was... Yeah, look at that shot! That Dude, show shot. that, Tim. That was a good shot. It came right at us. <laughs> Boom, baby. It did take me two shots. I missed it the first time. I knew I shot left. But I used to love shooting levers. That was something I did a lot with my dad, so pretty fun. We used to uh, throw up little cans and stuff and shoot them with a uh, lever and then also a, uh, a little little revolver. Pretty fun. That's a good shot. That is a really good shot. I got to give you that. So now it's Trent's turn. Of course, he wanted to really outdo his dad. Right. Fortunately, he missed his first shot as well, but he smoked it the second shot. But good shooting, buddy. Thank you. That was awesome. It. We tied up on the uh, aerial paint can <laughs> with the old Rossi 92 lever 357. Super fun gun to shoot. It comes up. Trent just smoked a plate at 100 yards twice. So that gun's dialed, ready to go. And we're going to try to see if we can get a turkey with it. Yes, sir. That'd be pretty fun. Let's do it. <laughs> nice shot, man. Dude. <laughs> I glassed up some turkeys in the field and we decided to drop down to the river bottom, make a big hook around and see if we could get in front of them. Well, we slip through the trees and Trent makes an incredible shot on this turkey. Lever action, open sights. Now, I did take the bog death grip to give him a solid shooting platform, but Trent made one heck of a shot. Nice shot, Trent. Oh, we got it. Dude, let's go. Spot and sock turkey with a lever Rossi 92 357. Yes, sir. Let's go. All right, I got to range this to show open sights with a lever. 
61 yards. Let's go. <laughs> What's fun about the fall turkey hunting? We've shot them with handguns, yep. ARs, now a lever, yep. you know, shotguns, a little bit of everything. So what's really neat, Colorado allows you in the fall to use different types of weapons um, for fall turkey. And it doesn't have to be a gobbler. It can be a gobbler or a hen. Yep. So Trent took the shot he had a good shot at. That was awesome. Yes, that I, dude, my heart was pounding. <laughs> we set up the bog. Check out the bog. We, I was carrying the bog just to give Trent a little bit of a, of a more stable platform but you shot great at the range. Yeah. We were shooting cans out of the air. <laughs> this gun is zeroed. Yeah, it's good. Nice yeah. shot. I love this gun. Look this at your sick. Turn. <laughs> that was awesome. Good shooting Thank with you. the Rossi <laughs> lever 357. Over the years, we've shot turkeys with everything. Recurve, yeah. compound, yeah. crossbow. With AR. AR. Shotgun. Uh, shotgun, muzzle loader, loader. handgun. Yeah. Lever, yeah. do we even say shotgun? I don't even know. Yeah, we've killed a lot of shotguns. <laughs> but a lot of different weapons um, and hunted turkeys all kinds of different ways. And this was a spot in stock. You know, I carried the death grip with me, so Trent had a stable platform. And it was fun. Yeah, Slipping along the river bottom, we kept peeking out and glassing. Yeah. Set up once and we got really close. Oh, yeah. You almost shot. I you were, yeah. I saw him on the trigger and I'm like, he's gonna shoot right now, but you held. Yeah, nice job, <laughs> nice job. This is a beautiful big old hand. That is. She is gonna be delicious. Time to get the outdoor edge out. Yes, and then uh, guess who's gonna clean her? Uh, I'm gonna guess me. <laughs> <laughs> Good guess. <laughs> and uh, we'll have Trent show you uh, how we like to clean, the clean turkeys and uh, that is awesome, man. Good job. Thank you. Well, you're watching Everything Eichler. I'm Fred Eichler. I'm Trent Eichler. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you enjoy watching this spot and stalk turkey hunt. Yes, and now we're gonna take you and, uh, and show you how we're gonna take care of it. Yes, sir.